CARE is a partnership between SCOE and the district, and it's an alternative education program that basically says, hey, let's not wait till students are credit deficient in high school and I have absolutely no path to success to start the alternative education model. Some kids will learn in spite of the teacher. These aren't those kids, and they just need a little bit more time with a positive adult that holds them accountable, and that's what the CARE teacher does. And so we start it sooner, freshman year, eighth grade year in my case, um, and it's really a school within a school model. Let's keep them on the same campus so they have access to all the electives, all the, the after school enrichment activities. Because we find the more you hook them into school, obviously, the better they want to do. The only difference is on their schedule, they have me four times, you know, and the other students understand the same exact thing. So they see me for four hours a day and then they're in their regular electives, you know, they go to PE. You know, it's hard to be out there eight periods a day, but if you have a home base for half the day and then you can branch out, it's great. They love it. And I think this class is like basically just for kids that needed a little extra help and it's like almost like a second chance for them to understand things. Students are selected for the CARE program um, with SCOE personnel, my director, uh, working with the admin at the school site. They identify students basically they have D's or F's in most of their classes which tells us they were not successful in that mode. We take it a step further we look at why weren't these kids successful? Was it just they weren't doing the work? Was there some serious concern that needs to be addressed in some other way? And if we find students that just didn't do the work for whatever reason, usually social, behavioral, um, we say let's, let's give it a different, a, a try in a different way. And that's how they end up here. The best thing about this program is the autonomy, okay? They say these are students that haven't been successful in the normal classroom setting. So they give me resources, time, ideas, um, just contacts with, with different people in the community to, to do whatever I need to do to make these students successful. And what we find is, with little bits of change in the delivery and the system, we learn everything they do, just in a different way. I understand the math more, and I understand like things that I couldn't before. Um, they're a lot more easier, like I can look at a problem that I probably didn't know how to do, and I'll be like, oh, I know how to do that. Coding is mathematical reasoning, it's algorithms. Uh, basically. You tell the computer to repeat this pattern and it does it for you. And the great thing about it is it's instant feedback. Okay, a lot of what goes on in education as far as disengagement is lack of feedback. And so what the computer does for us is gives us instant feedback on mathematical algorithms. And so this, this is mathematical, it's scientific, uh, computer science, all kinds of applications. Well, with coding, I kind of learned how to like make like your own type of games. Like you could start from with nothing and just like add obstacles, add all that, kind of creating like your own kind of game. So it kind of helps you out if you want to create a game later on in life. The biggest gains we've made are in the attitude towards school. You're never going to learn if you don't want to learn. I mean, before I started being in this class, I kind of thought it would be bad. But as the time went by, it kind of, I mean, it helped me a lot. Because last year, I, didn't, I really kind of struggled. But with this teacher, I mean, he's really helped me a lot. He never leaves anyone behind or anything. He helps you a lot. When you look at your classmate and you see that they, they just helped you accomplish something that you couldn't accomplish before, that builds that, that sort of just inroad, you know, that bridge. And they don't forget that. We become a community in this class because we're together all year. We're together for a long time. But this is a huge part of it, A huge because we're a team. It is definitely different from other classes because you're with the same people and then you have the teacher a lot more. You know, it helps. Um, with things that you struggle with, like math or English. Once you build that confidence, it's like a snowball rolling downhill. And you really, mathematically, I've seen huge gains from these kids, huge gains. Reading, everything, everything. They're just more engaged. They're, they're willing to take risks because it's a safer environment. And their achievement levels are far and above what they were last year. We see increased achievement, increased attendance, and it's stuff like this. You know, they don't, they don't wake up in the morning excited to come and solve for y, y equals mx plus b, you know, but they, they do look forward to coding, they look forward to hanging out. And I do too, I love it.